For this week's In Focus, the Middle Ages return to northern Minnesota as one kingdom battles it out on the field. Our Brenda Mack tells us more. Fighters, on your guards! Single death! Lay off! It is a battle of the Middle Ages as kings and queens, vikings and dukes geared up and fought for their honor in Bemidji Saturday. We've been doing this for about 15 years now. We've been doing this since uh, 1982, so a very, very long time, over, over 30 years. These combatants are from the North Shield Kingdom, one out of 20 other kingdoms stationed all over the world. They are also part of a worldwide organization called the SCA. The Society for Creative Anachronism is a historical recreation group that is involved in recreating the Middle Ages, perhaps not exactly as they were, but perhaps more as they should have been. Here the combatants are practicing to sharpen their techniques and teamwork. Each year they go for war, the biggest one at Pennsylvania called the Panzec War, which attracts more than 10,000 people annually. It is the most exciting thing I have ever found, frankly. There's more to it than just uh, uh, the fighting, there's, there's learning about the past, and, and that I find is just exciting. Yeah, learning anything is, is exciting. So. The most crucial part about being out on the field is safety. That's why many combatants build their own armor that also recreates a particular period in time. Helmets have to be made out of steel. They have to, you, you see there's, there's a bar that runs across the eye slot, and so the helmets have to be constructed in such a way that a one-inch dowel can't get through there. Each member picks a specific period in time to study. For many, this is also more than just a hobby, but rather a lifestyle. The SEA has pushed me to become a better person in, in every aspect, not just in terms of being more physically fit. Um, I'm also a knight, and part of what that means is acting in a chivalric manner being honorable, being charitable, being uh, a shield of the weak, protecting those who are less fortunate. Amazing how times, how many times that skills that I've picked up in here have used, been useful to me in, in the, you know, the modern life. You know. The SCA has practices weekly and welcomes anyone interested to join in. For this week's In Focus, Brenna Mack, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.